Why am I walking slowly? Uh, okay. Grab some. Oh, emeralds. That's helpful. Uh, right. That's a quest too. Emeralds. Boop boop. There we go. Oh, look at this. I'm trying to hide these from me, huh? I always do. <clears throat> ah. I like that. There's books. Oh. Bottle of experience. Oh, this is someone's hot tub. This is also a time machine. That would be funny. How would they in <laughs> integrate a time machine into this game? I'm gonna jump down from here, but like, okay, whatever. It's fine. All right. So this is where we came in at. It. No, it isn't. Almost where we came in. What the heck is the statue? What is, what is the statue? What is this? Oh, it's a shovel. Welcome to Shovel Land. What is this? Oh, it's a... That's... Amazing. It's just a, a villager. It's just a statue of a villager. <laughs> I like it. Oh. Uh, yeah, oh, don't mind if I do. Get out of my way. Get out of my way, pig. Move it, pig. This means that they're... Oh, okay. No, that's just for food. <clears throat> Oh, wow, okay. That's like another statue. Okay, so we want to go back over here. Wow, look at that. It's like a crane lifting up hay. hay. That's pretty cool. Alright, this is where we're at. Give me back that. Alright. Okay, let's see. Ooh. We want to make our base somewhere inside the town, right? Or outside the town. Actually, this way is fine. On this side of town would be a good place to start our base. So, how do we gonna? How do? Oh yeah, that's that's perfect. Look at this. Flat land. Look, very, very little flattening is needed. Awesome. All right. Okay. So, yeah, I guess we need building material now. But, um, let's do this. Let's just start that. There we go. We go and we will just start building. Just put some... Make some corner right here. There we go. Throw down some random stuff. What is that? Am I that close to a... Okay. 
Is this village that close to a um, pillager outpost? Oh my god, it is. <laughs> Uh. All right. So let's swap out some. Oh, did I get more diamonds? No. Okay. I should actually make a regular bed though. So let's do that. That way we actually have a save spot in case we die. Uh, there we go. Mm, remember I have to hit B to get to my... So. This is our little our tiny base. Uh, so what do we do as far as the basics here? Oh. Ponder. Yes, I know how ponder works. Andesite alloy is made from andesite and either zinc or iron nuggets. So that's not too difficult. We just have to find some andesite. And now we have a bunch of weird experience thingies. I'm going to throw all this in here. Um, hmm. Throw that in here. So that stuff that we don't really need right away we can just put it in there and I'm gonna have to go back to this town and grab all their books and everything else here but I know that there's that weird um, actually there's well I've got iron so that's not a problem I just need to find andesite and this weird like rock formation over here looks like it would be a good place to find some andesite. The only thing I don't like about this mod pack is that is that you have to actually break these in order to get them. I don't see that growing anytime soon. Alright. Did I? Okay, I did. some wood in my backpack but I need just to find andesite over here looks like things are on fire oh that's a good idea did I bring it okay I've got two coal I will make some torches this looks like this would be an interesting uh mining operation whoa look at I already okay I see andesite so we're just gonna hit that real quick I hear a witch. I hear a zombie. I am already, uh, okay. All right. Hang on a second. Okay. Okay. What are you doing? Why are you flooding me? Yes, which <laughs> uh, the dripstone is useful, especially if I have a bucket. Actually, yeah, let me grab this dripstone. This is actually hella useful. Early game lava generation. It's a lot of copper. I'm gonna grab it. We need it. Although, honestly, andesite is probably what we need more of. We're going to start doing crate stuff. And zinc. Zinc is good. Alright, alright. I guess the other thing that we need is kelp. Kelp for belts. That's going to be kind of important. some of this, some more andesite, a 
There's also a bunch of shafts already over there, so that's not going to be that big a deal. But I do need to find kelp. What am I? Okay, that's a skeleton. All right, let's let's head out of here. <clears throat> I will grab some of this coal. A, because it gives us experience, and B, because it gives us coal. <laughs> coal is useful. All right. I don't want to spend all day mining, though. Oh, hello. So, we got some andesite. Are those? Okay. Let's go back over to our miniature little base over here. Let's see what else this guy has in here. I don't think I I don't think I rated him properly. I know I looked in this. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take that obsidian. That's gonna be helpful. <sighs> and a saddle. Saddles are not easy to come by. I like the, the zombie. Oh yeah. Okay. I'm glad I came back. That's probably very useful. Hmm. I do not have a helmet yet. Oh. Oh, I do have a helmet. Pfft, sorry. <clears throat> not very observant, I guess. Oh, it's raining. But then it isn't raining because we're in the savannah and it never rains in the savannah, but it rains over here for some reason. Because I guess that's not a savannah? Like a river biome in the middle. Oh, it's another one of these. I didn't see this one. I I did not see this one. I will raid it. There's probably no diamonds. Oh, I'll take it. I'm gonna leave that there for now. Are there more diamonds? Oh yes. Why well, yes, there are more diamonds. I will take them. Thank you. And we will put some of this stuff in our bag. I would like some more of that obsidian though. Oh, oh right. I guess I would... Oh. I was just saying I need early game lava. It's right here. I can make a dripstone lava generator like right now. <clears throat> so, I mean, obviously I'd have to make a bucket first, but all of these things both have lava, so whatever. Ugh, it's just raining. Ugh. I hope I came in here. No, I did. This is where I got uh, the string. There's books in here. Okay, I'll grab some, some props. I'm not cops, but I did come and snatch your crops. I'm not going to blow your house down, either. Uh huh, okay. Got stuff growing in here. Alright, these buildings are actually pretty good to create buildings. Like zinc nuggets. Um, <laughs> Oh, okay. Yeah. Um. Okay. Actually. Wow, the other ones do not have a little thing like that. Uh, so you could maximize this if you put a large uh, cog wheel here, and then a smaller cog wheel, and then you know the, the millering thing. Actually, let me just take your cog wheel. And the other thing. Whatever. <clears throat> Alright. So. We got more of that. We got... We can make some andesite now, right? Yeah. Nine andesite. That's great. Okay. 
So, Andesite Alloy. Oh, well, we get Andesite Alloy as a reward. Shafts as a reward for finding a shaft. Uh, we get Cogwheels as a reward for finding a Cogwheel. So that's good. Enchantment Industries. Okay, we we'll get more experience for finding a uh, We found Raw Zinc. Cool. Um, we are far too far up in the world to find redstone dust at the moment. But, I mean, we could definitely get a diamond pickaxe. And that'll literally just give us our, our, our diamonds back. Isn't that nice? So yeah, let me just do that. So we just moved right across this whole quest line right here. <laughs> it's very quickly. Um, mainly because we found this village. But this village is going to help us out in the future. Alright, so... Put that in there. Okay. Um, so what do we want to make and create? We probably want to make... Oh, we need belts. So we're going to have to find kelp. Uh, all right. Fortunately, that might be difficult. Let's, um, throw some of this stuff in here. It's going to be perfectly safe in our backpack. Nothing bad could ever possibly happen to our backpack. And also, we'll upgrade that. Okay. <clears throat> oh, these are carrots. Okay, I didn't have carrots before, and now I do. Uh, so, oh, what do we have here? Look at this. This is beautiful. Best place to find ore and stuff, but we need kelp. Which is probably not going to be found in this little lake usually found in ocean biomes so oh so maybe here <clears throat> excuse me let's go this way yeah let's go this way see if we can't find the ocean biome uh. definitely want that Also, make some shears, which is going to be helpful for not killing so much sheep. There's a lot of lava here, a ton of lava. All right, here we go. Sheep, 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 sheep. Uh, don't put torches down. Okay, got all of them. I did not pick up the wool. Keep moving. Gazelle. Oh god. Okay. Uh whoa. <gasps> Ooh. That's that's pretty cool. That's very useful. That green stuff will you know you can uh grind it up. Grind it up. It's a fly. You hear that? <clears throat> help me, help me. Not the fly. A fly. Oh. So. Mm. Probably want to make a boat. This will be very helpful. Alright. Make a boat. Make a boat, make a boat, make a boat, make a boat. All right, so make a mob boat, boat. No. Grab that back up and off we go. I need as much. Yeah, there it is, kelp. Lobsters, ravens. Don't you dare steal anything from me. 
All right, off we go. Hopefully we don't get eaten by a sea monster. You know how it is in this game? You're just going along minding your own business when suddenly, you know, you just get eaten by a sea monster. Just cut them all through like this, like that. We're going to need a ton of kelp. Okay, up, back up, back up, back up. And now we just wait for it all to float to the surface and we just go and collect it all. Spin around in our boat, collecting kelp. Gonna need as much of this as we can just get. To be honest, I didn't have to collect a lot of it in my world and didn't really need too much more. But there we go. <clears throat> we are kelped up. We got at least a stack, which to be fair, we can make a kelp farm. <clears throat> And we'll be fine. No big deal. Alright. So we got our starting little area. I think I can just take this all the way around to the town. And we go this way. I could take it all the way around, but I don't want to go all the way around. I just want to go straight back to my base. Cook up some kelp and make a couple of belts. Um, I think something that we want to make... Oh yeah, we need a lot of wood. Definitely need a lot of just logs. There's logs in the town. We'll just grab the, the town logs. <laughs> the town logs. Not from their buildings, mind you. And we're hungry. Um, there were some logs on the other side of town. Yeah. There's some right there. We're gonna grab these. That way we can make some andesite casings. That's gonna be great. They all look the same, and it won't matter what kind of logs we use, that's fine. But here we go. Some logs. Nope. And over time, we will come through and beautify this town, obviously. We'll trade with the villagers and give them some jobs. That sort of thing. It's gonna be a great, great fun experience. But this was the best starting town, actually. Uh, let's see, are these onions? Oh yes, onions. Didn't have onions yet. All right, so let's see. All right. <clears throat> Take these. Oh, give me that. There we go. Cook some of that up. I'll just wait for that to cook real quick. go there's at least one uh i think we might have quests completed no um oh they have that we're gonna need a ton of funnels so that's actually gonna be helpful uh a wrench how do you make a wrench oh so i have to make a mechanical press first before i can make that how do i make oh we're gonna make an insight casing and then we can make a mechanical press which is probably the next thing to make um, and a depot and you can make a hand crank and you don't have to do anything but like make your own sheets basically it's great I found that to be the quickest way to actually start off everything is just to make yourself a little little hand crank <laughs> there we go now I can do this we go made a belt and it'll give us more belts funny enough let's throw some of this stuff back in here just because our inventory is getting a little full uh, I'm gonna start 
mm, a mine, I guess. All right. <clears throat> so I want to make a mechanical. Okay. So let's make this first. Need our andesite alloy. There we go. See, our bag is already full almost. That's amazing. All right, so what are you doing? Oh, right. <laughs> you have to strip the logs first. Forgot about that. There you go. So we got our andesite casing. It's going to give us a bunch more. We got a millstone, which is going to give us some of those. Cogwheels, yay. All right, so now we've got a bunch of cogs and stuff. And, oh, there we go. We can make a depot. We also need to make a, oh, I need more iron. No. We need more iron. Ah. All right. Um. Hmm. I hear uh, something with uh. Okay. Don't I have iron? You hear it? All right. Let's get away from it. <laughs> um. I want to say that there's more iron over here somewhere, somehow. No. Okay. I haven't checked a lot of these, so I don't know. Um, I need an iron block. I want to say that there's probably one in here. There was in the other one. Darn. This is not made the same way. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna do something very un. How? How are you right here? How? Doesn't matter. Whoa. A lot of fish under here. What the heck? The turtle? What? Weird. Okay. Um, okay. Are there arrows up there? I can't reach it. Let's see. I, uh, okay. 